Wetzel Quaddle Entertainment presents Women's Animation Extravaganza, Episode 152, The Mesmerizing Dream Continues. Usagi! Usagi! Get a grip! Wow, I ended up here again? That's really weird. Why do I keep falling asleep in my own bed and waking up in your apartment? It must be that dream you were having. I see. Anyway, I got to get to school. See ya! You know, I can tell somebody's incorporating that mesmerizing dream into Usagi, don't you? The question is, who's doing it and why? Only one way to find out. But first, I think we'll stop by Hooper's store for some lunch. Come on! Hello, Quentin. How are you today? I'm doing fine, but I'm a bit concerned about my friend Usagi. She keeps having a sleepwalking dream, and now she thinks we might be related. Well, that's a perfectly good reason to be concerned about her. I'm sure she'll pull through eventually. Anyway, what will it be today? I'll have a 10-piece chicken nugget meal with fries and a Diet Coke, please. Alright, coming right up. Alright, so Usagi's about to get out of school soon. Let's find her after lunch. Also, if she and I are related, then we would probably be like cousins or something. Okay, one ten-piece chicken nugget meal with fries and a Diet Coke. Eat in good health. Thank you! Nom, 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 nom. <laughs> Alright, let's go find Usagi. Now keep in mind, we need to find whoever's incorporating the best mind dream into Usagi. Sure hope it's not another evil organization or anything. Oh my god, what was that? Oh no, three serial killers are broken out of jail, ready to wreak more havoc. I must stop them at once. TRANSFORMATION! Well, the ultimate power puffs here, huh? Well, say your prayers, kid! Um, I don't think that's a good idea. This guy defeated the entire Black Cross army. He's right, James. That guy's really something. Yeah, coming from the guy who ruins everything whenever we play board games. Say your prayers, asshole! Oh, I can't wait to get started. Prepare for a major ass-kicking! Oh no! Usagi's having that mesmerizing dream again! What? That cat had been incorporating the dream into her all along? Wait, that cat looks strangely familiar. Oh, hey, Quentin. Luna, is that you? So you finally figured it out. Well, I can explain. There's something about Usagi that she doesn't know, and I think you ought to know this as well. Well, can this wait? Because these serial killers are about to... Transformation! Did Usagi just turn into a power buff? Okay, now I'm totally convinced that we're related. You freaky little Powerpuff wannabe! I'll make you sorry you ever mess with us! Guaranteed! Damn! Usagi single-handedly beat those serial killers! All while in the most fast sleep! The cops have arrived to reclaim them! Alright, it's time to wake Usagi up! Huh? I ended up here now? Weird! Huh? Since when did I find this super cute outfit? Oh my god! Am I wearing a Powerpuff uniform? Yeah, surprising, ain't it? Usagi, long time no see! Luna, you were the one who put me in that dream with me this whole time? Yep. Anyway, I'll reveal everything to you two tomorrow. I'll be waiting for you at the snack shop dawn. Okay then. Alright, Usagi. You may now have a point about the two of us being related. Really? Well, I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, I can hardly wait what Luna has to say about Usagi and me. Could we actually be related to each other? Oh well, I'm sure we'll find out tomorrow. Stop by whenever the time comes, okay? Alright. See you later.
This episode was an original story created entirely for this show. Written by Quentin Cole, copyright 2019. This program is a production of Quetzalcoatl Entertainment. This is PBS, the public broadcasting service.